Today, we've got some thrilling news for all the Samsung fans out there. We're diving into the latest developments on One UI 7.0 and how it might soon be available for the Galaxy F55. Let's get into it. Samsung has been hard at work developing the Android 15 base One UI 7.0, which promises to bring a slew of new features, design improvements, and various other changes. Over the past few months, Samsung has been diligently testing this new software on several of their devices. The big news today is that the Galaxy F55 appears to be the latest device to join this testing phase. A new test firmware for the European variant of the Galaxy F55, model number SMA556B, has been spotted on Samsung servers. This was brought to light by a reliable source at Lindy Randall 2 and we've got the screenshot to prove it. The test firmware carries the version of 556BXXU4BXGA. Now, what's really interesting here is the change in the build number. In the current official firmware for the Galaxy F55, the build number ends with A, specifically a 556BXX4AXF3. However, the latest test firmware ends with B, a 556BXXU4BXGA. This change from A to B signifies major changes, which could mean a new version of Android, a new version of One UI, or even both. This is a strong indicator that Samsung is indeed testing Android 15 base One UI 7.0 for the Galaxy A55. So what can we expect from One UI 7.0? Well, Samsung's One UI has always been known for its user-friendly interface and packed features. With One UI 7.0, we can anticipate even more refined design improvements, enhanced customization options, and a smoother overall user experience. Features like improved multitasking, better privacy controls, and new widgets could be on the horizon. Now, the burning question on everyone's mind is, when will Samsung release Android 15 Base One UI 7.0 for the Galaxy A55? Earlier this week, there was a report suggesting that Samsung might roll out the beta version in the third week of August. However, a more recent report has cast some doubt on that timeline. While we don't have an exact release date just yet, the fact that the test firmware is already being spotted means that we're definitely one step closer to the official rollout. For those of you who own a Galaxy F55, this is certainly exciting news. The anticipation for One UI 7.0 is building, and it's only a matter of time before we get to experience all the new features and improvements firsthand. Keep an eye out for updates as Samsung may announce the beta testing phase soon. In the meantime, it's a good idea to make sure your Galaxy A55 is running the latest official firmware to ensure a smooth transition when the update does arrive. To check for updates, go to settings, scroll down to software update, and tap on download and install. This will keep your device up to date and ready for the upcoming changes. The Galaxy A55 is already a fantastic device with its impressive specs and features. With the addition of One UI 7.0, it's set to become even better. Whether you're using it for productivity, entertainment, or capturing moments with its camera, the new software update will enhance your overall experience. That's all for today, folks. What are your thoughts on the upcoming One UI 7.0 for the Galaxy A55? Are you excited about the new features and improvements? Let us know in the comments section below. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Today, we've got some exciting news about Samsung's upcoming foldable smartphones. If you're a tech enthusiast, you're definitely going to want to stick around for this one. We're talking about the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Fold 6 series, and more specifically, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, which is rumored to be coming to China and Korea. Let's dive right in. Among the many Galaxy Z Fold 6 models that are currently in development in Samsung's labs, the one that has everyone buzzing is the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Now, if you're familiar with Samsung's ultra-branded smartphones, you know they are designed to be the best of the best, offering high-end features and cutting-edge technology. While the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 is expected to bring some minor incremental upgrades, all eyes are undoubtedly on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. However, here's the catch. The Ultra isn't expected to get a global release. But don't worry, it seems this powerhouse of a device won't be restricted to just Samsung's home country, South Korea. According to the folks over at Android Headlines, Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra could also be launching in China. This is particularly interesting because it seems the rumored Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim, which we've been hearing about with its slimmer body, bigger displays, and larger battery, might actually be the Chinese variant of the Fold 6 Ultra. If this is true, it would clear up some of the confusion we've seen in recent weeks about how many models Samsung is actually working on. It might just be two the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. The Ultra, limited to Korea and China for now, 
would allow Samsung to gauge interest levels before potentially bringing it to a wider audience. In China, the Z Fold 6 Ultra may be sold as the Samsung Go E25, complete with unique visual touches like decorative engravings on the hinge, similar to previous Samsung Gilead smartphones. And here's another interesting tidbit. China might also get the Galaxy Z Flip 6 as the W25 Flip. This is speculative at this point, but it aligns with rumors that Samsung is also working on a Galaxy Z Flip 6 Slim. Now, unfortunately, there isn't a lot of detailed information about what exactly the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra will offer compared to the Z Fold 6. This is probably because the Ultra model isn't launching alongside the standard model, but we can expect more details to emerge once the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 goes official at Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked event next month. Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked events are always full of surprises and we can't wait to see what they have in store for us this time. Will the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra live up to the hype? Will it bring groundbreaking features that set apart from the standard model? Only time will tell. To be an upgrade. While rumors suggest a larger display and a slimmer design, the lack of S Pen support might be a deal breaker for some users. Ross Yanon also mentioned that production for the Z Fold 6 Ultra's display panels might begin later this year, with a launch expected in January alongside the Galaxy S25. This staggered release makes sense. It avoids competing with the July launch of the regular Fold 6 and keeps the Ultra exclusive to South Korea for now, which might frustrate international buyers. Speaking of launches, rumors suggest the next Galaxy Unpacked event might be happening on July 10th in Paris, France. However, Tipster E-Leak's list of expected reveals didn't include the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Does this mean no Fold 6 Ultra this year? Probably not. E-Leak's list might only include devices launched leaked photo a few days ago, looks a bit cheap and out of place on a flagship smartphone, expected to cost over $1,500. The device in the picture also appears to be wider than the current Galaxy Z Fold models, suggesting that Samsung is increasing the display size. However, the screens won't be significantly bigger. Samsung is reportedly saving the major display size upgrade for the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra and Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim models, which are rumored to launch alongside the standard Z Fold 6 this year. Now, let's move to the front. The first hands-on image of the Galaxy Z Fold 6 has leaked and reveals that Samsung has finally listened to Galaxy Z Fold users. The new foldable phone will feature a wider cover screen compared to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. Reliable tipster Ice Universe shared this full image showing the front of the device and comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. As you can see, the upcoming foldable phone will have a wider cover screen that matches the width of the Galaxy Z Fold 5's cover screen plus one of its bezels. This wider cover screen should improve the typing experience on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and resolve aspect ratio issues in some apps and games. The new foldable also appears to have much sharper corners for both the body and the cover screen. A tipster shared a photo that seems to show a new camera module for the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. Although the leak only indicates that the camera module will feature a new design, it's doubtful Samsung would implement a design change without also upgrading the camera hardware. Here we have the first look at the new Galaxy Z Fold 6 outer display. A Twitter user named Ali recently shared a render comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. According to Ali, the new outer display features a boxier design and a slimmer hinge, significantly enhancing a Fold 6 overall appearance. The most noticeable difference between the Fold 5 and Fold 6 is the wider cover display. The render clearly shows what do you think about these changes? Are you excited about the wider cover screen and new design? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the latest tech news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.